This is Today in Nashville, a celebration of the people, places, and things that make Music City a great place to live. Now your hosts, Kelly Sutton and Carol Sullivan. Good morning, we are back. Everybody recovering from last night's game. I know, it's hard. It's gonna take more than coffee, girl. You think this is coffee? <laughs> Unfortunately, Pittsburgh is taking home the Stanley Cup. I don't want to talk about it. But cheers to the Preds for their incredible run. I'll tell you what, say what you will. We showed the entire nation yes. what a hockey town the we world. are. The world. Absolutely. I mean, there were these stations that were from Finland that were here, and they were covering everything. So it was just like, you know what? We're on a like global campaign now to show everybody how amazing I we are. I imagine the Finns were quite pleased with. They really, you <laughs> they're know. They're like, wow, Nashville, they got Nashville's going on. pretty good. We got it going on. And we have beer. So it's going to get better. Yeah. We have a summer beer tasting coming up in a few minutes that will help us forget what happened last night. So we'll just call this show, like, show therapy today, right? Okay. I'm, I'm okay down with that. With that. So this yes. guy's got a lot of weight on his shoulders. <laughs> get ready to perform big here, Billy. Billy Rafool's on the Hard Rock stage. He's performing for us in just a few minutes. He is playing with Kings and Leon this summer. That's kind of amazing. And you get to hear his debut single coming up. Stay tuned for that. Okay, take a listen to this song. Feel the breath in my face. Yeah, this song. Everybody so what do you think of? Dirty dancing. Totally packed with Swayze. Dancing. Oh my gosh. She's out of my league. I'm not going to sing it. You know what? I, I only can sing see, like I can see you what? karaoke with this song hard. Anyway, we won't do it today nope. because we've got the songwriter on our show. Stacy Widelitz is Stacey. here. There you go. He wrote She's Like the Wind. He's hanging out in our Beach Whiskey green room. He's now into politics as well. Local politics, God love them over there mm -hmm, at Oak Hill. Mm -hmm, and mm -hmm. we're glad he's here. It's going to be fun. We're going to find out more of the story behind this song. Plus, get ready. We are taking you inside Orange Theory Fitness. It's like combining personal training and a group class together. Casey Haggerty is taking us to one, and she's going to show us how it's done. Oh, God, she makes it look so easy. We could use that. We could I just use a little saw bit of that in our life. Well, yeah, yeah. But instead, we're going to have Chef Paulette. She's in our Super Home <laughs> Surplus Kitchen with strawberry shortcakes. Aww. Okay, so she is doing a deconstructed version of this with fresh fruit. Okay, so it's a very hipster word. We're going to find out what it's all about when we come back. You know what? Food makes me happy, so I'm I'm glad that's going to drown Food and summer heart. beers. Yeah. It's yeah. all good. good. Uh, all right, so let's talk about the happy stuff that happened yesterday because our city really did shine. I mean, it was unbelievable showing off the fans. Oh, and oh, yeah. oh it, We impressed the world. And Luke Bryan took to the rooftop at Tootsie's. I mean, that was kind of a fun surprise. On the concert, free concert, did anyone else get nervous that he was standing so close to the edge? Take a look. There you know, you there at that angle, you can't get a feel for how close to the edge he was. He was standing way up on that, and I thought, okay, if Luke Bryan takes a nosedive onto Broadway, that is not good for tourism. Although, I believe there, there were, were enough, enough people, people. They would have caught him. For they sure. Caught him. It been right. fine. And even if they missed in the catch, there would be bodies to cushion it. Absolutely. All right. The <laughs> entire <laughs> series, Nashville, put on an incredible show. It continued inside Bridgestone last night. I mean, we always love the pregame. It is so amazing. So the production value alone is just like no other. And then the national anthem, Faith Hill. <laughs> Amazing moment. Then Tim comes out, waves the flag, and gets the crowd going. Here he comes. Oh, we cut him off. Tim, you don't get any. You know what's so great was um, one of my younger kids said, "Now, who's he married to?" I'm like, "He's married to her." <laughs> <laughs> It was so great. I love yes. seeing both of them. Yeah. Okay, so between the Stanley Cup and the CMAs, I mean, huge crowds, amazing stars. So on Friday, we're going to show you the No Excuses workout with Carrie Underwood's personal trainer, Erin Opria. She is amazing. Look at her clients. This is them this on the red carpet. CMT Awards on Wednesday night. So you've got Carrie there, Lauren Elena, who is looking amazing. Also, my girl, Kelly Pickler. She looks incredible, and Kelsey Ballerini, both my girls. So, what's the magic behind these rockin' bodies? 
We look at these celebrities and we think, we can't do this. They, they have all this. No, what they have is a lot of discipline and a lot of hard work and determination. Because really, the, that, the bottom line is you have to decide to eat healthy. If you don't eat the right things, it doesn't work. I mean, it doesn't matter. And then there was this. And then that's the picture that Kelly sent us last night of her nacho tray at the Stanley Cup. <laughs> You know what? Here's the problem. Like, I, I just hear Aaron say, you've got to eat the right stuff. And then I made so many bad choices last night. I but like that. That's cheese and cheese. Did I, you ask for double cheese? I was eating my feelings because this was after they took the goal away from us. And I'm like, I just need nachos. And he goes, do you want double cheese? And I'm like, yes, I want double. I looked at what him kind like, of what kind of question was that? We just got a goal taken away from us. Put more cheese on there, please. Just well, like... Yeah. Kelly, then on that note, what are we eating mm. this morning? <laughs> what are we eating? Bum, bum, bum. I think this is perfect for our Monday. Oh, look at it's from Arby's. Pizza sliders. Oh no, wait, how do you know? Because it's not on the screen. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I can read. Pizza sliders from Arby's. Look, I got I need my readers. I'm handing this over to Tim oh, so I can stop. eat it. Pizza sliders. I'm in. Pepperoni salami, <laughs> melted provolone on the slider. They're only a dollar. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Look at that. Wait, maybe not at that angle, because it, it's been sitting here maybe for a minute. Well, no, go. it still looks good though. I'm okay. Eat it. Limited time. Half I pound of roast beef night. sandwiches, eight ounces of thin sliced roast beef, Arby's. Curly fries and orange cream shakes. Okay, pizza sliders going in. Oh my. I am a fan. Mm -hmm. I'm a fan. I'm going to oh sit here and eat this. Hey, by <laughs> the way, really good. <laughs> this is not getting taken away. Don't even touch that tray. Go to the Today in Nashville Facebook page right now or the WSMV.com contest page because we're giving away tickets to Holiday World. Take your bite. I'll tell you all about it. Each week, one winner will get a pair of tickets. You have to be a legal resident of Tennessee or Kentucky. Got to be 18 years old. Free tickets to Holiday World. Go to our Facebook page, Today in Nashville. Good luck. I think it's the pepperoni that's so good. It's so good. There's a little tang to the sauce. I'm into it. Pizza sliders, Arby's. Thank Happy. You.